happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. The doctor will tell you what is good for you. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. And if you're feeling poorly, just remember this tune. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Cause the doctor and nurse, well, they know what to do. They do. They'll always take good care of you. So be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. The doctor will tell you what is good for you. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Hello, my name's Dr. Ranj. Welcome to my surgery. Are you well? Yeah! Ah, oh, good. Someone's not feeling well. I wonder who my next patient is. Who's come to visit me? Who will it be? Can you guess which friend it is? Let's see. It's... Riz. The world's so full of what and why I really have to know how does it work and what is this and where does that thing go so much to know so much to learn and do when i find out something new i want to shout so much to know so much to learn and do when i find out something new i want to Come on in, Riz. Hello, Dr. Ranch. Hello, Riz. What can I do to help? I've been invited to my friend Natalie's birthday party next week. It's a very special party because Natalie is having a swimming party. That sounds oh. great. Oh, why are you so sad? Well, I'm not going. Huh. Why? I've got these itchy patches on my arms and they look funny. I don't want the other children to see them and I'm really worried about the water making my arms even more itchy. I'll try not to scratch, Riz. Do you think the water makes it worse? Yes. When I'm having a bubble bath before bed, my arm itches like crazy and goes all red. My skin's all scaly like a slithering snake. Oh, that is sore. I can see the skin's all dry and cracked. <gasps> I told you! I'm turning into a snake. I saw that happen in a cartoon once. There was a boy and he had special powers. And when he needed to save someone, he turned into Snake Boy. Da -da -da, to the rescue. Nyam, nyam, nyam. Ha -ha. You're not a snake, it's a rash. And Riz, can you keep still for me? I'm trying to have a look at your arm. Please don't scratch it, it'll just make your arm more sore. You said it's worse after a bath. What are you putting into your bath? Rubber ducks. <laughs> oh, I mean, what kind of bubble bath do you use? Oh, I've got this bright green bath slime called, um, um, bright green bath slime. It makes the bath look like a swamp, but it smells like bubble gum. Why? Ha ha! Oh. Riz, please stop scratching. I can't. It just feels so. <laughs> All right, calm down. Let's see if this helps. <laughs> Instead of scratching, you can play this balloon guitar. Thank you, Dr. Ranch. I think I know what's causing your skin to be so itchy. What? You've got eczema. That means your skin is extra sensitive and gets overexcited trying to protect you when it doesn't need to. That's why it's dry, itchy and sore. Oh. We should listen to your chest as well. OK. OK. Now, Riz, take a deep breath in. And out. <laughs> and in. And out. OK. Some people with eczema have problems with their breathing, but you're absolutely fine. It's just the eczema. When it itches like this, I wish I didn't have skin. Oh, don't say that. Your skin's one of the most important parts of your body. Really? But why do I need my skin? 
That's a great question. Let's ask Nurse Morag and the healthy helpers to explain it to you. Yeah. Hello, Nurse Morag. Ruth? Where are you? I can't see you properly. Yes, it's me, Nurse Morag. I'm a bit fidgety because I'm trying not to scratch. Oh, what's your question? Nurse Morag, why do we have skin? Ah, now that's an excellent question, Ruth. But I think I'll need my healthy helpers to help me answer that one. Catch that ball, yeah, it's your goal. Give me questions, catch and through. Healthy helpers will show and tell how you can keep fit and well. Catch that ball, yeah, it's your goal. Give me questions, catch and through. Healthy helpers will show and tell how you can keep fit and well. We'll show and tell how you can keep fit and well. Ask me what you need to know. Give me questions, catch and throw. Today I'm in London and my healthy helpers are... Hi, my name's Chantal and I like drawing rainbows. Hello, my name's Alfie and I like making cupcakes with my cousin. Hi, my name is Isla and I like going to the fun fair. Hi, my name's Emma and I love jumping muddy puddles. Now, why do we have skin? What a good question. <gasps> oh, and I see lots of hands going up. This is great. OK, one at a time. Let's start with you, Alfie. So we don't just see the bones, we see the skin and there's liquid in your body, so... So that's why they put skin on you, everywhere on you. Um. That's right. Excellent answer. One of the things that skin is really good at is covering us up. And it keeps what's inside, inside. <laughs> A bit like my backpack here. In my backpack, I have sunglasses. I have <laughs> my purse. And it can be good. I have my... Stethoscope, <laughs> my apple, and my whistle. My backpack keeps all my stuff together and it keeps it nice and safe. And if I didn't have my backpack, I'd lose everything. Well, you know, our skin's a bit like a backpack and it keeps our insides inside. But what is inside as healthy helpers, do you heart. think? Blood, that's right. And, and blood. also, and heart. And a heart. You have the lungs. Yes, you do. And what do you think would happen if we didn't have skin to hold it all in? We we can't walk or run or bike in or, or sit. We just have to lay on the floor, that's all. So skin's quite amazing, isn't it? Shall we play a game to find out more about why our skin's so amazing? Yeah! OK. Come on, then. Right, healthy helpers. What we're going to do is play a game with the dressing up clothes to find out some of the amazing things that our skin can do. Now, we've got teeny tiny holes in our skin and that's because when we get hot, our body lets out the sweat and that's what cools us down. So the first thing we need to find is something that has holes in it. Are you ready? Yeah! OK, then go. Quick rummage through, see what you can find. We need something with holes in it. Oh, oh. Yeah. <gasps> Perfect! So, Leila, you put the tutu on for me. Oh, that's looking good. The next thing I'm going to want you to look for is something that is stretchy and bendy, just like our skin. Hello. That's Hello. good. But, oh, perfect. That's what we're looking for. OK, Lila, you put on the leggings. The next thing I'm going to get you to look for is something that's waterproof, just like our skin. <gasps> I think the girls have just done it. Well done, we've got our three things. Now, we have a tutu with lots of wee holes, just like our skin. And we have leggings that are stretchy and bendy, just like our skin. And finally, we have a waterproof jacket that keeps us dry, just like our skin keeps our insides dry. 
So Riz, look after your skin because it's really important and it does so many different jobs. And Riz, we all hope you get well soon. Bye. Bye. Hmm, skin's more important than I thought. So what can I do to get better, Dr Range? Well, because your skin is sensitive, you need to be careful about what you put on it. So no more bright green bath slime. Oh, puddles. I like bright green bath slime. But your skin doesn't. It doesn't like the colours and smells in it. Instead of bubble bath and strong soaps, I'd like you to use this emollient. A mole in it? A mole in it? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! An emollient is a special cream that you use instead of soap. And also, I'd like you to put this into your bath water to keep your skin nice and moist. It's not as exciting as bright green bath slime, I'm afraid. I don't mind, really, if it helps stop this itching. It will. And finally, I'd like you to use this cream on your skin several times a day to keep it nice and soft. Will it make my skin smooth and lovely like yours? <laughs> oh, thank you, Riz. Um, hopefully, yes. Can I take all these home now? Yep, I'll give these to your dad. It will take some time for your skin to get better completely, but if you use everything properly, you should be feeling much better soon. I can't believe you've got a song about itching. Eczema, eczema, smooth on the lotion now. Oh, that feels good, smooth on the lotion now. OK. Oh, that itching feels so bad. Don't let it get you down now. No. Don't let it make you mad. Oh, I Give your skin health right away Rub that cream right in And do it every day I will Squeeze it on your skin You know that you should, should. Rub it right in Now that feels good. good Eczema, eczema Smooth on the lotion now I'm doing it Oh, that feels good Smooth on the lotion now Like this It makes your skin so red and dry Yeah, it did that's why you need the lotion, so let me tell you why. Give your skin help right away. OK. Rub that cream right in and do it every day. Yeah. Squeeze it on your skin, you know that you should. should. Rub it right in, now that feels good. Good. Eczema, eczema, smooth on the lotion now. Oh, that feels good, smooth on the lotion now. So, remember to put that cream on, use those things in the bath, and let's see if that works. Your eczema may not disappear right away, it could come and go. But usually it gets better as you get older. Will I be all better in time for the swimming party? It should be much better by then, but don't let eczema ruin your fun. If anyone asks, just tell them it's eczema. Lots of people have it. They won't catch it from you, and you just need to put some cream on after swimming to stop the itching. Do you think you'll go? Hmm. I really want to. Yes, yes, I'm going to go. I'm not shy about it anymore. I feel so much better already. Thank you, Dr Ranch. And here's your badge. Oh, puddles. What's wrong? I've got to go and make Natalie a birthday card. I'm going to use pasta. Bye, Dr Ranch. I'll bring you some birthday cake. Thanks, Riz. Bye. And bye-bye to you too. I'll see you next time. Until then, be happy, be healthy. And foot and mouth disease. Dotted dotty spots with none upon you.